Evans, weather from where you live. Well, this actually is a thunderstorm in Benton County tonight. These are not the wind farms. This is an actual thunderstorm just east of Fowler, very slowly drifting southwest. Where we've got a little shower here in southern White County that's basically collapsing now, and a little shower here south of Crawfordsville. Now, if we broaden out and look at our Doppler 18 network, a lot of very, very interesting, what we call mesoscale features, mesoscale boundaries today. It was so incredibly hot today with temperatures in the mid 90s that with that cold Lake Michigan, we had a cool lake breeze rush out from the lake and it was strong enough to pop a storm or two and bust through the cap. So we've had a couple of storms on the lake breeze front. This boundary, which has popped that shower near Crawfordsville, is an old outflow boundary from storms yesterday we had in Missouri. So a lot of inter uh, pretty interesting analysis for meteorologists today in our local area. Let's go to 3D now, which is our regional satellite and radar. You can see there's the lake breeze thunderstorms, and then there's that outthrow ba outflow boundary that's rushed through southern Illinois. So for the evening hours, can't rule out an isolated thunderstorm, but the bigger feature will be over Iowa tonight. I'm going to watch for the potential of a cluster of storms to form here tonight, and if that does happen, it would move through tomorrow morning with the potential of some severe weather. If that doesn't happen tonight, and there's some question as to whether it will, we'll see a more organized severe threat tomorrow afternoon. So it's either tomorrow morning or tomorrow afternoon when the severe threat develops. So let's check it out now. Again, today, temperatures in the 90s. Heat index 100 to 105. There's tomorrow's map. Whatever forms in Iowa tonight will pass through tomorrow morning. If it can't get going up here, again, the main severe threat will be tomorrow afternoon. Friday's looking okay, but still hot at 92. But a bigger severe threat may evolve on Saturday. Squall line of storms popping here, and that could uh, move through the area late in the afternoon and towards the evening. So tonight, again, 72 for the low, some scattered storms, still muggy. Hot tomorrow, 90, 90, sun and clouds, still some scattered storms possible. And after a break on Friday, more storms for the weekend, severe weather potential by Saturday. And then after a break from the heat Monday and Tuesday, we're back to heat and storms by Wednesday.